welcome back. We are closing in on day 18 and we're going back into yesterday we did mermaid and floating butterfly and snuck that in there. Today we're going to go from our mermaid pose into a bat hang pose. So to do your bat hang pose, which is a lovely pose, feels awesome, really secure. Again, we want to grab the edge of the hammock and fan it out. Turn our backs to it, underneath the rigging point, press down, hop up, wiggle in. Swim the arms around and behind. Grab the edges right by your hips. Leaning back, bring your heels inside. Grab the edges above your head, lifting your hips up and lengthening your legs to cover your lower body. So you might have to walk down a few times. The hammock can be really finicky, just be patient. If you're in the Northeast like I am and it's, in, it's November, so it's winter time-ish, it's gonna be very staticky. I don't know if you can tell, my hair is going everywhere right now. So it is what it is with hammocks, but I still love it. So we're going into mermaid first. So the fabric goes into my waist and I lower myself down. Now keep holding on. The legs now have to keep nice and straight and strong and they're gonna open up. As you open them up, they're gonna float up to the ceiling, okay? When you're doing that, so bear with me as I turn, you wanna hook so your legs look like this you want to hook your feet around and in securely on the edges that you're holding on to. So you have a nice and secure grip with your feet before you let your hands go. Once there, you can relax the arms, breathe, allow the spine to release and decompress here. Crown a head towards the floor. And this is a really lovely place to just hang and relax, especially if you're doing an aerial yoga practice before Shavasana. It's your last inversion, perhaps. As you come out, you want to do a little sit-up, reach for the fabric, the tense points underneath your ankles, and once you've grabbed them, unhook your feet and slowly bring them back together. Sit up and then slowly find yourself reaching for your toes to a forward fold. Option to bend the knees if that feels better in the lower back and the hips. Take a few deep breaths to recenter yourself. And then grab the edges, pedal the feet through, and carefully drop down to the mat to come to standing when you're ready to come out. So thank you so much for joining me. This was, we went from mermaid and we floated right into bat hang with this one. And we're moving along steadily with our aerial yoga pose challenge here on YouTube. Keep tuning in. If you've missed any days, you can always go back and re-watch them. Don't forget to hit subscribe so you do get these right into your feed whenever you log into YouTube, or you might even get it into your emails, which would be fantastic. Thank you so much, guys. Have a great day. I'm so excited to announce the release of the Ariel Silk Curriculum Journal. This has over 100 pages inside where you can write down and record all your silk skills and sequences that you learn in the studio or on commafittv.com. Inside, you'll find that there's a table of contents that will guide you through this, but every single knot or lock that you can create in the fabric is outlined for you and then there are plenty of spaces for lines for you to record any of the skills that you learn in your studio no matter what your instructor calls them. At the very end too, I'm really excited about adding in, there's conditioning and warm up drills so it gives you guided pictures, imagery, and text that tells you how to properly warm up and then conditioning drills you can do at your studio and then workouts you can do at home or at the gym in addition to what you're already doing at the studio to up your aerial game. Also at the end, there's a whole section on nutritional guidance. And this nutritional guidance will be there for you as an aerial athlete who's looking to supplement your workouts and get the best out of your workouts. So all of this is for you. It's $14.99 right now on our site. And all you have to do is pay shipping and handling or you can pick up in the studio. Please check this out. There's sample pages you can look at on our website. Take a look. I'm so excited to show it to you. And thank you so much for everything, guys.